Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. So today, I wanted to um, bring to you something that I came across um, quite a while ago, but I haven't really um, gone too deep into it. Um, but recently, I've been motivated to get back into it by a fellow YouTuber um, called Kevin Maguire, um, who, who runs his uh, YouTube channel and Facebook group, um, <clears throat> and I'll, I'll link to those at the end of the uh, video. Um, but let me start by showing you Adobe. So Adobe is is world renowned. Um, it is considered the gold standard for anything design. Um, so you can come and check out the website. That's Adobe.com. Um, <laughs> a lot of us are familiar with PDFs, for example. Um, but Adobe is really well known for anything graphics, you know, um, and they've got a whole suite of programs all right so photoshop indesign premiere pro um, video and film editing illustrator for vector art and illustrations um, design and prototype user experience you know so I, I won't go through every single one of these things but um, it's basically a cloud-based um, service um, and you can get different plans um, it's a subscription service so, you know, feel free to check out Adobe's website. I, I don't have any affiliate links or any affiliation with them whatsoever. Um, I want to just share my thoughts on this. So if you click, <coughs> excuse me, if you click into the pricing plans, you can take a look um, at all the programs they offer. So this is the individual. You can choose the business or student teachers or schools and universities. but. Um, let's say you're an individual um, and you wanted all the apps, which is the best value as highlighted. You'll pay about 53 US dollars a month. Okay. Um, now, for my purposes, I don't need, you know, um, a pricey package like that. Personally, I've used Spark, but I don't use the the monthly subscription. I use the free one. Um, there are limitations, of course, um, but there it is. Um, you can you can try that. InDesign is for prints and digital media, which is very very popular for merch. So like T-shirts and <clears throat> um, you know book covers and that kind of thing. So you can check out InDesign. Now I came across this other program, um, and before I go into that, uh, make sure you smash that thumbs up button, um, subscribe to the channel. Um, so let's continue this uh, video. Now, the Royal College of Art in the UK, and this one's Rhode Island's, um, um, sorry, Rhode Island School of Design. So these two are very, very famous um, arts schools, and both of them use Adobe Suite of some kind. So the, the, the page I'm on shows the Adobe InDesign for this particular um, university, Royal College of Art, the Rhode Island School over here specifically refers to Adobe Suite over here. So, you know, Adobe has definitely cemented their uh, their role as the go-to program, um, but there is an alternative, and it's, uh, dare I say, a, a lot cheaper. <laughs> uh, it depends on how long you plan to use it, and you'll see why, but it's called Serif, S-E-R-I-F. Um, so when you come to the website over here, um, you'll see they've got this thing called Affinity Suite of Products. Um, so the website, I'll include a link, it's affinity.serif.com um, and they essentially offer um, similar lines of um, products to Adobe at a much cheaper price. Okay, <laughs> so let's take a look. So Affinity Publisher is I guess um, the equivalent would be something like InDesign um, and then Affinity Photo equivalent might be something like a Photoshop okay and you know feel free to browse through whatever else they have to offer but essentially you're, you're looking at you know Canadian $70 which is maybe a US dollars of about 50 or thereabouts and we'll go through some currency conversion um, after this but this is a much cheaper um, alternative 
right? So if you wanted to do InDesign and Photoshop, you're looking at $21 for each, which is $42 a month, okay? Whereas the Affinity products over here would be a one-off payment of about $70. Um, now, I, I'm not going to claim to be an expert on this, but my understanding is the, the offering between Sarif and Adobe is very similar, um, except um, Sarif is much, much cheaper. It may be that there isn't, you know, the full, you know, um, whack of systems that Adobe can offer because Adobe is obviously much, much more established. Um, as you can see, they've got so much they can offer you. Um, and it also comes down to how much of this you're going to use. So me personally, I've got Affinity Photo, Publisher, um, I think I've also purchased Designer. Now, I haven't used all of them. I've only started using Publisher recently. Um, so let's just take a look at how much it might cost. So there we go. So current exchange rate of $69.99. So just over $50 US. Um, I don't know how much that will be in GBP. Let's see, pound. Pound sterling. So let's say $50. So that's just under £40. Pounds. So depending on what the exchange rate is on the day itself, you know, um, you might pay a bit more or a bit less. Um, but definitely check out their website. So feel free to check out Affinity, Serif.com and um, Adobe.com. Um, I'll just quickly run through the two um, channels on YouTube that I'm following right now. So this is Kevin Maguire's channel, The Real Way to Make Money Online, and he does well, well let's, let's just take a look at the videos he's recently uploaded. Um, so he's talking about merch designs, affinity designs, and he actually goes through step by step as to how you can, you know, like like this kind of a curve over here on words. Um, he actually shows you how you can do that. Um, so, you, you know, definitely take a look at his website, um, sorry, his uh, YouTube channel and subscribe to it. He offers some really good um, tutorials like this. If you wanted to create a button, sorry, an on-off switch, green and red, you know, he actually shows you step by step how he actually did this. Um, you know, feel free to check it out and you can just follow along. So that's one of the channels I'm currently using to um, kind of guide how I personally use um, Affinity products, um, especially Affinity Design. And the other one I wanted to bring to your attention is Rachel Harrison Sun. If you don't know her, she's quite famous in the um, low content publishing space for uh, books on Amazon KDP, Kindle, Kindle Direct Publishing. Um, and she's done a whole load of affinity publisher uh, videos as well um, on how to use some of the, you know, functions in there, master pages, um, create a weekly planner, text styles, um, affinity designer so uh, and she actually compares you know um, some of the tools that affinity offers so definitely check out her channel as well so that's Rachel Harrison dash Sun um, and again I'll include links in the description below uh, so that's it for today's video slightly longer than five minutes but under 10 minutes uh, if you enjoy the content you know please subscribe to the channel smash that thumbs up button drop a comment and until next time have a great day.